high school business class here in Knoxville taking technology to the community. Virtual Enterprise students at Bearden High created a simulated company that collects donated socks to be distributed to Knoxville's homeless shelters. And after a competitive interview process, each student is assigned their own job from company CEO to chief marketing officer. The team then spent the past couple weeks going around the community, visiting local businesses, and promoting their cause online to raise these much needed donations. New at 4 WATE 6 on your side reporter Bridget Biorlo shows us how the course works and what students hope to achieve by giving back. It may look like a business office, but it's really a classroom at Bearden High School. Students of the Virtual Enterprises Corps gather here each week as they build and operate a simulated business. They work together to put together a business model and decide what kind of business they're going to be, uh, the products that they want to market, how they're going to promote themselves. And really, I mean, the same exact same thing that a real world business would do. A business created by the students themselves. We wanted to make from the start a company that did benefit the community. That company, Global Warming, warming the earth one sock at a time, where students provide East Tennessee shelters with hundreds of socks for the homeless. We're bringing a good connotation to it, so maybe instead of Bad global warming, they'll think of warming the globe the right way, which is the way we want them to think about it. Um, giving the socks back to the homeless shelters and making the community better. Students say the demand for socks is there, with socks being the most requested clothing item at homeless shelters around the country. And it's a cause students say local businesses and community members want to get behind. Students set a goal of collecting 900 socks this month and have already surpassed that number. The idea of like donating socks to like the homeless community is just like something people would want to help out, and so seeing all the socks come in, I was like, I think it was not really that big of a surprise in the end. The class not only making a difference in the community, but also in the lives of students who say they will carry these lessons learned well into their professional futures. Usually, like in other like textbook classes, you kind of just remember for a test, and then you kind of like forget after you're done. Like for this class, like, I feel like these like, are skills that I'm going to use like, throughout my entire career. In Knoxville, Bridget Bjorlo, WATE 6, on your side. All right, thank you, Bridget. You know, the Bearden High School class is preparing now to compete against other virtual enterprise businesses run by students around the country. That conference, by the way, will be happening at the LeConte Center in Pigeon Forge on November 9th and 20th, or 19th and 20th, I should say. We're told more than 1,600 students from seven states will attend this event. Best of luck to the kids in Bearden.